Morning. Cat got your tongue? Yeah. Look, uh, this business with Sean, right? I was uh, probably wrong, OK? What? Was that an apology? Yeah, but don't push it. Maggie, you should be at home resting. That's a nice thing, I must say. I struggle all the way in here and I'm told to go home. I'm not an invalid, you know. Morning, Max. Morning, love. A new look from the Paris catwalks. Bradford, more like. <laughs> Don't encourage her. Look, I have taken the weight off of it. And anyway, who's going to run my kitchen? Well, we'd manage somehow, wouldn't we? For a day or two. Quiet you, you don't have to manage. You're out there. Well, that's another reason why I'm staying. You see, I'm going to make certain that Melissa gets a good send-off meal. Do what you want, Maggie. You want to see me, Gov? Uh, come in. How are you feeling today? Yeah, a lot better. It's the first good night's sleep I've had in ages. Sally, the police phone this morning. It, it's nothing to worry about. Sean's been detained in custody until the trial. He won't be getting bail. I mean, the jury might still let him off. With what Pitbull and I heard, the police seem to think they've got a pretty solid case. Sally, you don't need to worry any more. It really is over with, I promise. I can't quite believe it. I'm so sorry you had to go through all this. Yeah, well, it's like you said, you know, it's all in the past. I can't get on with my life now. It's what Joe would have wanted. 